First, we've got to get through this, and as you can see, we do have some drops on the uh, camera out there by the airport, so the roads are damp, and the light rain continues to work its way off to the east, and there is an end in sight further out there to the uh, west. Still a couple of, uh, you know, straggling little showers there in portions of uh, Medina County, and we have these showers that are moving through. This is what we're looking at at the airport as of right now, and then obviously a couple of more down there, oh, just to the east of 35. Those will continue, again, primarily in an eastwardly direction. So a few little leftover showers. Uh, it is kind of breezy out there, so it takes these numbers and knocks them down a little bit. 47 degrees, so it's not bone chilling cold, but with that wind out of the north, now the front has moved on through and about, oh, say 15, 20 miles per hour, then gust about uh, almost close to 25 miles per hour out there at Lost Maples. And so that is definitely adding a chill to the air also with all that moisture out there. So it kind of sneaks down the back of your neck. It feels like 34 degrees right now at Kerrville 41 here in town. And as far as the allergens, no mountain cedar showed up yesterday. So maybe we got an early end of the season. Hopefully we'll uh, check out the updated count later on this morning. 46 degrees this morning, a couple leftover showers, and then the wind is going to continue to pick up throughout the day. 56, mostly sunny skies. We're going to clear out very nicely. Uh, this rain will come to an end this morning, and then we'll see some sunshine later on this morning, a whole lot more this afternoon. But again, very, very windy, and then the wind settles down, and then the cold air settles on in here. But like I said, fantastic weekend. Details coming up in just a couple of minutes. Tiffany.